Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And, uh, well, Microsoft has confirmed that after the latest update on Windows 11, those of you that are connected through a VPN uh, might see really bad speeds on the connectivity. Now, not everybody is affected, but those that are see really, really slow internet connectivity and sometimes even some timeouts. So uh, there's no workaround, but Microsoft confirms that they do see the issue and that they are working on a fix and uh, that um, eventually there's no, of course, date of when that fix is going to arrive, but that the only workaround is to roll back the update that was pushed if you roll back and remove the update, you are getting your speeds back on the VPN side of things. So that means that uh, it's the only way to go if your VPNs aren't working well with the latest update on Windows 11. It does not affect Windows 10. I see some users saying, what about Windows 10? Windows 10 has no problem with that. It's really just a Windows 11 issue. And they're investigating. They don't see why exactly it's happening right now. So um, if you do have that VPN problem, uh, they do say that uh, just rolling back, removing the update for now is the fix. And uh, hopefully that will be fixed uh, soon. For the rest, uh, they're not talking about any installed issues. They haven't mentioned that people, some people seem to have more problems installing the update itself uh, with two error messages being common right now with the update errors. So um, that is not addressed in any way. Um, it's difficult to address these issues sometimes because it could be due to, you know, third-party software, antivirus of some sort, or all sorts of things that, you know, each machine is different. And this is the, complex, uh, the complexity of Windows. A lot of people complain about how there's, uh, you know, it's difficult on Windows for certain things. But the problem is, is that contrary to a Mac, uh, Windows has to control, you know, millions and millions of configuration where Macs are all the same with very little variations in hardware. So uh, hang in there, and if you really need to have that VPN working, removing the update is the only way to go, apparently, according to Microsoft, for the time being. If you are enjoying my video, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.